with everybody on the internet. I'm just going to take a brief respite here. I'm also going to introduce you to my friend under the table who made his first debut on world television today. There he is. <laughs> That's Eggsy, everybody. He's, he's helping us with some lighting and, well, he's making the odd cameo appearance. I think we might have to give him some sort of costume. I think he wants your job, Joe. I think he wants my job, too. Certainly he's appeared more often than I have tonight. Well done, everybody. We're in the advert break. That was much uh, less uh, frenetic, I think, than the last time round. Um, good. The sun's come up. Looks very nice. Maybe we can go to the... Uh, can we go to the... No, I don't want to tax too many people in the final control. I um, wonder if we shouldn't go to the balloon, see what's going on there, shall we? No? We can stay here. We must accept that the, in the final control there is now a huge amount of work going on. They're working, they're doing a lot of stuff. Finger puppets with the sun. What's this, Fergus? Guess what that is? A uh, duck. It's a duck, yes. Uh, let's go to the balloon if we can, Kirst. There we go. Some beautiful pods of hippo, which unfortunately did not make an appearance. Ooh, and there on the northern bank, oh, there's a buffalo. I thought they were wilden beast. All right, apparently we are... I'll just keep you posted as to what's going on. We'll come out of the advert break with those cheetah. Isn't that just so special, spending time with those cheetah? I, I, I can't believe that we've had that luck with them, and I think they're going to become the leading characters in our migration story then, and of course the Angama pride. Beautiful shots there from Senzo Mkiza, ex Guazulu Natal, enjoying his time in the balloon. He's sitting with Steph today, I think. Yeah. I think Steph's enjoying himself there as well. Probably giving a little bit of moral support, you know, suspended above this wilderness, unfamiliar. Now we're back into the triangle. And let's see if we can't spot some elephants or buffalo in and around that area. Muting myself, still who had to try to find some migration characters at the river. You might be wondering what this is. Uh, well, I don't know which river. We need to find a crocodile, Kirsten. Hold on, everyone. Oh, we've got one minute one only. How are we going to do it in one minute one, Kirsten? How are we going to find a crocodile in one minute one? I found one there yesterday. Ah, oh, oh, no, 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 I am in control. All right, let's go back to Scott. No, cancel, don't go back to Scott, stay here. 30 seconds, 30, there is a crocodile, brilliant stuff. Uh, main north, sorry, cursed, main north. Uh, yes, I do. Stay here. Stay here. Welcome back, everybody, to your live migration safari. I am about to be clutched within the jaws of one of the villains of the migration, as I said. But rather than this rather nasty skull, we have got the real deal. Let's